Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. People of God, welcome back today. Welcome back for another moment of prayer. People of God, today we'll take a moment to pray. We'll pray to ask God. We will pray because the Lord has given us the power to pray against all the work of the enemies in our lives. So we must stand and pray. It is true that you can ask God for help. We must ask God for help. But the Lord is asking us to stand and pray. The Lord wants you to pray. The Lord wants you to rebuke. He wants you to stand and fight, people of God. If the Lord has been revealing some things to you, it's because the Lord wants you yourself to pray. It is because the Lord wants you to pray against it. The Lord is calling on you to deliver the members of your relatives because the Lord has chosen you. You are the chosen one. The Lord has given to you this assignment to release your family, to break the chains in the family. The Lord has assigned you to break the yoke, to deliver your children, to deliver your life. Hallelujah. He has given us authority, people of God, and we must know that the Lord is with us. We are not alone. We are never alone. He said to us in his word, he will never forsake us, people of God. Hallelujah. So my brother, my sister, it's time to pray. It's time for us to pray. There is no more time to waste. You must stand and say stop to the enemy. You must stand and say stop to that monitoring spirit that has been in your relatives for generations, that has been watching you, watching your progress, that has been controlling your life, controlling your marriage, controlling your health. In Jesus' name, now is the time to say stop. Now is the time to rebuke that enemy. Now is the time to break down all spiritual altars that you have in your life, working against your life. In the name of Jesus, Jesus, we must take authority over them, people of God. So today, people of God, we will be praying for deliverance. We must deliver ourselves because the Lord has given us the full authority. The Lord has given us his powers. Hallelujah. So before we start praying, people of God, we will read from the word of God. The word of God is saying in Matthew chapter 16, verse 19, people of God. And I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. And whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven. And whatever you loose on earth will be loose in heaven. So brothers and sisters, the word of God is saying to us that he has given us the keys to his kingdom, the keys to the kingdom of heaven. Hallelujah. So what else do you need, my brother? What else do you need, my sister? In Psalms 45 verse 1, he's saying, I will fight those who fight against you. The Lord will fight against those who fight against you, my brother, my sister. The Lord will fight your battle. The Lord will never leave you alone. He will never forsake you. The Lord is asking us, people of God, to stand and know the powers that he has given to us. The Lord wants us to take authority. Hallelujah. We cannot stay no longer silent and just watch what the enemy has been doing with us and the enemy are still doing with us, with our kids, people of God. The word of God is saying to us, people of God, we cannot do anything without his Holy Spirit. We cannot do anything without him. It is not by your own strength. It is not by the power that you have. It is not because you are strong or you know how to pray, because you know how to fast. It is by the Spirit of God. It is the Spirit of God that will lead you, that will help you in all your battles. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. In the book of Genesis, chapter 12, verse 3, is saying, I will bless them who bless you, and I will curse them who curse you. Hallelujah. The Lord will bless all those that will bless you. And the Lord will curse them that curse you. The Lord has given us his promise, my brother, my sister. The Lord has said to us, he will never forsake us. So we must stand and say, Lord, we are in need of you. So we must stand and say, my heavenly father, I am in need of you today. 
I am in need of you tonight, Heavenly Father. Now I'm saying I have enough with that situation. Now I'm saying I need to be set free. Now I'm saying that enemy, you take your baggage and you live my life. Now I'm saying, oh my God, without you, I'm lost. I'm in need of you, Heavenly Father. My God, I need deliverance. My God, I need deliverance today. I need deliverance tonight. My God, I have enough with that situation. My God, Heavenly Father, my God, my King, come, Lord, Heavenly Father. Hallelujah. Oh, Heavenly Father, I come before you today, Lord. Lord, I'm asking you for your grace and mercy, my God. I know you are the God that can deliver us. I know you are the God, Heavenly Father, that can save us, Lord. I know, Heavenly Father, there is nothing too wide for you. There is nothing too deep for you, my God. That's why I'm inviting your Holy Spirit today, Lord. I'm inviting your Holy Spirit tonight, my God, my King. Lord, we are in need of you. Lord, we are in need of you right this moment, Heavenly Father. Oh, my God, we are in need of your favors. We I need of your help, Heavenly Father. Oh my God, your word is saying to us, you will never forsake us. You will never abandon us, O Lord, my God. Your word is true, Heavenly Father. We have seen, Heavenly Father, what you have done for us in the past. We have seen, Heavenly Father, all what you have done in our lives, Heavenly Father, in the past, Lord. But we need you today, Heavenly Father. We need your miracles today. We need deliverance today, my God, my King. We need deliverance right this moment, Heavenly Father. Father. Oh my God, we need you supernaturally, Heavenly Father. We need you in our life, Heavenly Father. We need you, my God, my King. We are in need of you, King Jesus. We are in need of you, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh, I worship you, Lord. I thank you, my God, my King. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, Jesus Christ, hallelujah. Oh my God, Heavenly Father, oh my brother, my sister, today I declare that the Lord will touch you. The Lord will transform your life. That situation, that situation you have for so many years in your life, I declare, I declare today, I declare tonight that the Lord will touch you. The Lord will help you in that situation. The Lord will set you free. Our Heavenly Father will set you free from whatever situation that you are going through from whatever situation that you are going through, whatever you have been fighting with, whatever you have been struggling with, I command that spirit to lose hold right this moment. I command that spirit in the name of Jesus Christ to lose hold right this minute, right this moment, in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus, in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I know that the Lord will bless you with his blessings, all his blessings, supernaturally, the Lord will bless you. I pray to Today, that the Lord will bless you supernaturally. Pray today that the Lord will bless you, my brother, my sister, supernaturally. The Lord, our God, will work miracles for you. The Lord will bless you in a supernatural way. The Lord will open doors for you. Doors of favor today. Doors of favor will open for you today. Doors of favor will open for you today. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, all where the enemy has been holding you captive, all what the enemy has been been working against you no matter what they have no matter what point of contact i condemn it in the name of jesus i rebuke it in the name of jesus in the name of jesus christ of nazareth I command it to lose hold right this moment in the mighty and powerful name of jesus christ of nazareth i plead the blood of jesus on you I plead the blood of Jesus from the crown of your head down to the sole of your feet. I plead the blood of Jesus on you, my sister. I plead the blood of Jesus on you, my brother. I plead the blood on you. Lose all, all spiritual altars. Lose all, all satanic powers. Right this minute in the name of Jesus. Oh my God, I'm calling on you, Heavenly Father. We are in need of you, Jesus. You will never let us be ashamed, Lord. I rebuke that spirit of shame. Hallelujah. I rebuke that spirit of shame. I rebuke that garment of shame. Let it catch fire right this moment. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus. Catch fire right this moment. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus. You garment of shame. I rebuke you. 
catch fire, catch fire, catch fire right now in the powerful name of Jesus Christ, in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lose hold right this moment, lose hold right this moment. I rebuke you, I rebuke your powers, I rebuke whatever you have in my life, whatever spirit you have hindered me with, I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. I rebuke all hindering spirit in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lose hold, lose hold, lose hold in the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh my God, I thank you Lord. I thank you Lord. I pray today, my brother, my sister, so that the Lord will help you in a supernatural way. Supernatural way. The Lord will heal you. The Lord will touch you. The Lord will deliver you right this moment in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I command that spirit to lose hold. I command that devil to lose hold. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the Lord will heal you in a supernatural way today. The Lord will heal you in a supernatural way. Hallelujah. The Lord will bless you supernaturally in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Our Lord can make way where there seems to be no way. There is nothing too strong for him, my brother, my sister. Our God is a mighty God. Our God is a mighty God. Let God arise and let all your enemies be scattered in the name of Jesus. Let God arise for you today. Let God arise for you today. Let God arise. Let your enemies be scattered in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Let God arise in your situation. Let God arise in your marriage. Let God arise in the marriage right this moment. In the name of Jesus. My God arise. Arise my God today. Arise my God tonight. Arise this evening heavenly father. For my brother. For my sister Lord. They are calling on you for so long. My God, I know you can answer. I know you are the God that can answer prayers, Lord. I know you will answer them, Lord. I know, my God, you will answer them, Lord. I prophesy on them, Heavenly Father. I know you will open new doors for them. Doors of favor. Doors of healing, Heavenly Father. Supernatural healing, Lord. Supernatural healing will flow. Supernatural healing will flow. In the mighty name of Jesus, deliverance will flow. In the name of Jesus, let your Holy Ghost fire manifest Heavenly Father. Let your Holy Ghost fire pass and touch Heavenly Father. Let your Holy Ghost fire deliver someone today, tonight Heavenly Father. Let your Holy Ghost fire pass in that situation. Let your Holy Ghost fire pass in that house Heavenly Father. Pass in the workplace Heavenly Father. Oh my God. Let your Holy Ghost fire pass Heavenly Father. Let your Holy Ghost fire touch someone. Let your Holy Ghost fire deliver someone from witchcraft Heavenly Father. All spirit of bondage. All hindering spirit. Lord, let your Holy Ghost fire consume them. Let your Holy Ghost fire consume them in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command that every pit that they have digged, Heavenly Father, for someone, Heavenly Father, to trap someone, I command that pit to be covered right this moment. I command you to be covered right this moment in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh my God, your word is saying to us, Heavenly Father, that you have your angels there to guide us, to hold us, to protect us Heavenly Father from all harm Heavenly Father. Let your angels Heavenly Father surround my brothers, my sisters Lord. Open the floodgates of heaven Lord. Oh my God. Let your angels Heavenly Father surround them. Surround my brother, surround my sister Lord right this moment. Help them Lord from all harm, all dangers Heavenly Father, all the traps of the enemies. Wherever the enemy has put traps, Heavenly Father, to hold them, Heavenly Father, let it be without effects, Lord. Let it be without effects. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I command the evil work of the enemy to turn into blessings right this moment. Wherever they are cursing us, Heavenly Father, let all these curses, Heavenly Father, turn into blessings in the name of Jesus. I command them to turn right this moment into blessing heavenly father in in the name of jesus christ of nazareth heavenly father the word is said in psalms 
Heavenly Father 23, Heavenly Father, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He maketh me green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointed my head with oil. Oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Heavenly Father, you said, Heavenly Father, you will prepare for us a table in the presence of our enemies, Heavenly Father. Though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, Heavenly Father, we will not be afraid, Lord, because we are not alone, my God. I know we are not alone. I know my brother, he is not alone. My sister, he is not alone my God. Oh my God. Let them feel your presence. Let them feel your holy presence, Lord. I know, Heavenly Father, you will fight our battles, Lord. I know you are in control, Lord. Oh my God, I know you will fight our battles. I know you are in control, oh Lord. I know you are in control, Heavenly Father. I know, my God, you will scatter our enemies, Heavenly Father. I know, Heavenly Father, there is nothing too big for you. There is nothing too wide for you, Heavenly Father. Oh my God. Oh hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh my God, my King. Lord, I come against all evil dreams. I pray against all evil dreams. Oh my God, my King. I pray against all evil dreams. No matter what we have been dreaming. No matter what we have been dreaming. No matter what the enemy is using to control our life to dominate us heavenly father to take control of our blessings heavenly father oh my god to hinder our blessings, Heavenly Father. All monitoring spirits, Heavenly Father, that will work through dreams, Heavenly Father. Let your Holy Ghost fire consume it in the name of Jesus. I declare that you are consumed. Heavenly Father, let your Holy Ghost fire consume it. I rebuke you, you monitoring spirit, you hindering spirit. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, oh my God. Arise, my God. Arise, my God, oh Lord Jesus. My God, my King, I'm calling on you, Heavenly Father. I plead your blood today. I plead your blood tonight. Father, I plead your blood on my brother, my sister. Let all the powers of the enemies be destroyed, Heavenly Father. All monitoring spirit, no matter what they are using. Even though, Heavenly Father, they are working through dreams. Even though they are working through visions. Even though, Heavenly Father, they are using magical never thing. Whatever point of contact they have, Heavenly Father, whatever that they are using, my God, to monitor our life, Heavenly Father, let it be exposed right this moment in the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, let God arise in our situation. Let God arise. God arise. Arise, my God. Arise, my God, in our situation, so oh Lord. Oh, my God, my King. Oh Jesus, you are our deliverer. You are our deliverer, oh Lord. We are depending on you. We are depending on you, King Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, for your mercy. Thank you, Lord, for healing. Thank you, Lord, for deliverance, Lord. Lord, I bless your name, Lord. Hallelujah. I know, Lord Heavenly Father, you are the God that will answer us by fire. I know you are the God that will answer us by fire. Lord, I know that you have answered us tonight by fire. You have answered our prayers this morning by fire, Lord. By fire, you will fight our battle. Oh my God, by fire. By fire, you will fight our battle, Heavenly Father. I thank you in advance, Lord. I glorify your name, O oh God. I glorify your name, King Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah, Jesus. Let God arise, let your enemies be scattered. Let God arise, let your enemies be scattered. Let God arise, let my enemies be scattered. Let God arise, let your enemies be scattered. In the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah. Let God arise and let our enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus. 
So brothers and sisters, that's why I'm saying goodbye for today. Continue to pray, continue to rebuke, continue to destroy the work of the enemy with faith, my brother. With faith, my brother, my sister. Continue to pray with faith. You will see and you will see the hands of the Lord working for you. He will never abandon you. He will never abandon you, my brother. He will never forsake us. So goodbye for now.